And now, please join us in welcoming to the stage your Maroon Club Hall of Fame inductee, Kathy Novello. This honor means so much to me. Uh, thank you to the Maroon Club, its president, Bill Tucker, and the Hall of Fame Selection Committee. Thanks to President Hurd and Athletic Director, director Freeman for supporting this event. And special thanks to Lakeitha Murray for all of the work uh, she put into organizing this banquet. To my fellow inductees, congratulations. I am honored to be recognized with you. And to the 1983 men's tennis team, cheers to the other athletes in their 60s here tonight. When thinking about what to say tonight, I kept coming back to the same emotion, gratitude. Gratitude that I came of age with the passage of Title IX. It was a game changer for girls and women's sports. Gratitude for the incredible coaches I played for. My high school English teacher, a standout college football player, threw his passion into coaching high school girls and women's semi-pro softball. He saw in me a left-hander who he thought might make a pretty good southpaw pitcher, so he taught me to pitch. Gratitude to coach Pat Fisher, who was the first woman coach I played under. She was a talented and inspiring coach. Sadly, she passed away in September but we reconnected in the spring and reminisced about our seasons together. Gratitude to Lafayette for the opportunities my education and participation in athletics gave me. Once I stepped in front of a class of students, I knew I had discovered my passion. My instincts in the classroom were rooted in my experiences as an athlete. Sports gave me confidence and agency and tra translated to an effective presence in the classroom. Gratitude to an incredible group of teammates who I played with for four years, some of whom are here tonight. Gratitude for the connections that Lafayette Athletics and our Academics offered me. The principal, who you saw on the screen a few minutes ago, who hired me 40 years ago is here tonight. Fellow Lafayette alum, John Squarsha. Before he hired me, he called Coach Fitcher. Her endorsement helped me to get hired. Like my coaches, John was another inspiring mentor in my life. He brought me back to Lafayette to teach education in 2016. It is wonderful to give back to the place that gave so much to me. Gratitude to my parents and my sisters for their lifetime of support. And to Vicki, who I didn't know in college, but has indulged the many softball stories I have shared with her over the past weeks. Thanks, Vic. And to my friends and teammates who are here tonight, thank you for sharing this special event with me. This honor is a reminder that, to me that over my 38 years in public education, I taught and coached many students who had talent but did not have the support and resources to pursue a college education or collegiate sports. I had those supports and resources, and without them, I would not be standing here tonight. Just one caring adult who nurtures us, invests in us, is invaluable in our future success. I hope I have been that adult to some of the students I have worked with. So much of who we are and who we become is owed to the amazing people in our lives. I am lucky to have those people in my life. Thank you.